Hey guys, how's it going? This is the stamping nail art tutorial I have for you today. Uh, it's relatively simple. Um, uses a couple of uh, colors and as well as a dotting tool and an optional flaky top coat. So uh, let's get started with the tutorial. Okay, so I've already applied my base coat and I'm going to go in with a bright yellow and this is Color Club's Almost Famous. I'm just going to do a stripe right down the middle of my nail. Try and make that an even stripe. Next I'm going to grab a teal. This is All In by Color Club. Right, I'm going to go in with this teal on one side of the nail and I'm going to fill in that other third that is not filled in with the yellow. I'm just going to clean up that little smear on the cuticle. And now I'm going in with the purple, and this is Poochylicious by Color Club. Okay, and I'm going to fill in that last one third on this side of the nail. Okay, now that I've got that on, I'm going to allow that to dry before I move on to the next step. Okay, so I'm using this Bundle Monster, number 216, and I'm going to be using this design right there. I'm going to be stamping with my black polish. This is American Apparel's Hasid. This is a great alternative for a black stamping polish if you don't have the Conad Special Polish. So just apply, scrape off, pick that up, and apply it onto the top of the nail by the cuticle. Okay, so I'm going to grab my black polish and put a little on a piece of paper here on the side. I'm going to grab a nice long striping brush. And I'm going to just continue those lines that are in the middle of this pattern and I'm just going to continue them down my nail. And ideally I'll get it so it's kind of creating a separation line between the two colors. I'm a little off between the yellow and the green but that's no big deal. And because this stamp didn't really go on super perfectly, I'm just gonna kind of beef up a couple of these, a couple of these curves. And because you can also see a little bit of the yellow up there, I'm just going to fill that in so I get a nice, uh, nice finish by my cuticle. And next I'm going to grab a little more black on my scrap paper there. I'm going to grab a really wide dotting tool, dip into my black, and I'm going to do some fat dots going down and getting smaller down the nail in each of these sections. Okay, and I'm just going to wait for that to dry. Okay, so I've let that dry for a few minutes and now I'm gonna go in with my top coat, which I'm using as a glitter, uh, or flaky, however you wanna call it, and this is Sally Hansen's uh, Hidden Treasure. There are lots of other flaky sort of polishes you can get. This was one of the first ones that ever came out and it's actually the only one I own. I know Essie has uh, quite a few. And um, Enf Enfuo <laughs> has a lot of flaky glitters as well, or flaky polishes. It's kind of what they're known for. Okay, and that is the final design. Uh, if you don't have a flaky glitter or any kind of glitter that you want to use, I would just finish this off with a regular top coat and allow that to dry. So I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye!